Sorry, it's a dangerous city. Can you move out of the way? Hey, it's Nico. Hey, I'm just finishing my hair. Come in. Thank you. I'll be with you in a minute. Did you just move in? No. Why? All your stuff is new. Some even still have tags on. Yeah, well, I like things clean. I can see that. But uh, everything is new. Yeah, I'm kind of obsessed with cleanliness. Things get on my nerves and I just throw them out. OCD or something? Oh. So, where are you taking me? Uh, you look good. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'm new here. I thought maybe we could go to the, uh, fun fair. Yeah, great. Let's go. Love the fun fair. Actually, we call it, um, carnival here. It's just a little reference. Uh, whoop de doo <laughs> So, Michelle, what do you like to do? What do you like to do? Come on, I asked you first. I like to keep active, I guess. Sports, working out, things like that. I'd like to know about you, though. See the places you hang out. Yeah, maybe another time. Isn't open? I think they're gonna turn it into a big Las Venturas style theme park. 
Hey, there's a bowling alley up here. We should play. Cool. Let's go bowling, then. I need to get spun on meth right now. Thanks for taking me out. I haven't been on a date for a while. I'm kind of lonely here. I thought you were doing me a favor by going out with me. You're the local. I'm not Please, a local excuse. in Liberty City. I came here from somewhere... Excuse. Where? Uh, here we are. This will be fun. Let's play a few frames. Welcome to Memory Lanes. We have a lane open for you. More assholes, maybe. Shame we couldn't finish that game, Nico. It was fun playing, though. Can you take me back now? I'm not going to make you take the subway. Let's go. So, you don't know many people here in Liberty City? No boyfriends or husbands or anything? No, I guess I'm married to my job. Well, what do you do? What do you do? Come on, I asked first. I work with Mallory. What do you do, exactly? You're a hard girl to talk to, Michelle. I guess you're not used to talking to American women. I guess. So what are you doing here in Liberty City, Nico? What's anybody doing here? I don't know. I think you do. There must be something that made you leave your home and come here. Roman's bullshit stories, maybe. I just felt like I needed a new start. There's nothing else about Liberty City, then? Just Roman? Maybe there is more to this place. I'm not sure yet. That was nice. I'm really interested in seeing you again. Yeah, that would be good. I'll give you a call. Please do, Nico. See you soon. place, Roman. Anyway, I was seeing Michelle. I thought you wanted me to date her. Not when it means me getting beat up and sent to hospital. Come and pick me up, cousin, and at least tell me that you got her titties out. Maybe then your betrayal will be worthwhile. What nice titties, yes? who chose Cooch before his cousin. I hope she was worthy. Will you drive me back to the office, cousin?
How was she, cousin? Tell me how she was. I wondered about Michelle when I first met her. If she was not a friend of Mallory's, it would be me with the smell of titty on my breath, and you who ended up in hospital. Firstly, Morgan, my breath does not smell of titty. Secondly, I don't think that your long shot friends could hospitalize me. I can look after myself. All the more reason why I should have hooked up with Michelle. Everyone would be a winner. Yes, well, I will not let these men treat you like that again. I'm sorry for letting you down, Ron. I apologize again for not being there for you. You've done a lot for me since I got here. Uh, the choice between some titties and your safety would have been difficult for me as well. Don't worry, Nico. Call me soon. Don't make me turn on my My ex-wife could light my cigarettes with her pussy. So, yasna. I'm not going to let something else get in the way this time. Where are you? Over on the court, under the L train and Firefly. Bleed her body. You proved your point the first time. Listen, Darden is a good friend of mine. It was a misunderstanding. Oh! Hey! Oh, shit! There he is! Keep on fat boy here and I'll talk to him! Our problems with your cousin. I told you to stop! Now it's too late. Some more? You all right, cousin? Yeah. Fine. Fucking lawn sharks, man. If one more of these gangsters tries to... Speaking of shitheads, here's Darden. Come on, my car is over there. Let's get him. You drive. I don't feel so good. Get in the fucking car! Me and you, Nico. 
me, and you are going to show them. Fucking dirt and smashing my fucking stuff. Who does he think he is? To some fucking petty Albanian hood. If I wanted to buy a stolen TV, I'd go to Dark. Who does he think he's fucking with? Belik Enterprises, that's who. We're going to the top, Nico. The top! For now, let's just try to survive, cousin. Then they stop him. He's trying to get away on foot. Then nothing else. Darden ain't a problem, for you no more, cousin. Nice one, cousin. Drive back to the depot. These bruises are starting to pain. These men, these Shylocks like Darden, they always try to squeeze you for everything. A man in Europe, another Russian. Bulgarian. He live on the Adriatic. Believed I owed him money when I did not. It made my life impossible. There was no avoiding it. Did you deal with him like you did Darden and Bleeder? He had too many connections for that. I had to leave. He is one of the reasons I came here. And to see your cousin, of course. Of course. We will have no more problems from now on, cousin. It is all plain sailing straight to the top for you and me. We will see if things are that simple. Thank you, cousin. I'll see you later.
Come on, Hattie. Forget about the fat serf. Vlad's shots up. But he's a serf, and you're a countess. Uh, talking about serfs. Oh, hey, Nico. Where's Roman? <laughs> Good question. Hey, Yoko, your dumb cousin isn't here. Go get me a coffee. What? Get me a fucking coffee! Come on, I'll get you one. What? You keep staring at me. I'll burst one of your eyeballs. Gorgeous, this guy's a fucking creep. Give him a break. He's new in the country. I can see that. Did you walk here from 1985? Yeah. Excellent. Now stop fucking staring at me. I mean, I know I'm good looking and everything, but come on. Uh, hey, Mallory. Hey, man. Hey. <laughs> About time. Vlad, Vladdy boy, what's going on? Roman, Roman boy, you tell me what's going on. Nice aftershave, what is that, sex pest? No, <laughs> it's where is my fucking money? I, I had it, I, I had some of it. Then those Albanians you said you would deal with came and smashed my computer. <laughs> so it's my fault? I, I didn't say that. Good. Anyway, Nico dealt with him. He broke Darden's arm, then beat up a couple more. Then we teach them a real lesson. <laughs> Is that so? I tell you what. While you don't pay, maybe you and Nico can do me few favors. Sure. <laughs> Good. Why not? Later, Vlad. What? The phone's ringing. Hey. Yeah. Okay. No, I, I can't do it. My cousin will do it. Yes, he can drive. No, he's not a cop. His name is Nico. You'll be right over. Nico, sorry to ask, cousin. Can you go pick up Jermaine, one of my regulars? He's over on Rotterdam Hill on Mohawk Avenue? Whatever. What was this all about? Nico came in looking for you, and Vlad told him to get him a fucking coffee, and Nico didn't want to. Coffee? What was he thinking? I know. For coming. Can you take me over to Masterson Street? Nico, yo, Roman said you were reliable. No way! Shit, I thought Roman was gonna pick me up. I need someone I can trust for this one. I'm Roman's cousin. If you can trust him, you can trust me. Ah, uh, he told me about you. You're Nico, right? The hotshot ladies man cruising around the Mediterranean breaking hearts and making millions? Don't kill me! Yeah, I traded in the yacht for this cab. <laughs> it's exactly the kind of bullshit I can imagine Roman making up. You got to give him credit for his imagination. Yeah, you got it. I had a feeling you sounded too good to be true. The question is, are you willing to get your hands dirty? My hands haven't been clean for a long time. Being here in Liberty City is just making them dirtier. Okay, okay. I gotta pick up some hot cars from a locker. You down? I ain't got no problem with that. Just don't tell me if you stole this shit from a hospital or a school for sick kids. My conscience is troubled enough already. That door isn't meant to be open. Wait here while I take a look. Man, lose the fucking cop shit! I ain't going down, man. Get rid of this heat. You're really gonna need to get this car 
all fixed up. You can't do that in this country. Oh, sweet Jesus. Roman's not gonna like that. 360 to cut. Did you see I'm that? running into you too much, B. Crazy fucker. Shit. Good God. to shake them. We just need to lay low for another minute. Great. We lost So what brings you to Liberty City, Nico? Roman, I guess. And some other things. I'm looking for something. Good luck finding them. How's the hunt been going so far? It has not really started yet. I'm getting settled in, you know? Roman has had some issues with the loan sharks that needed to be resolved. There's this asshole called Vlad, who he owes money to as well. Good luck with that. Okay, we're here. Thanks, man. Keep looking after Roman, all right? I got your friend Jermaine where he wanted to go. Good, Nico. Thanks. I can talk. See you soon. Thank you, Roman Scarlett. 